I'm not gonna beat a dead horse on this, but since it's relatively simple, I am just I am going to. I hate. Come on here, pull off, pull off. It's relatively simple here. I'm just going to pull off these. Uh, let me get my keys. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to dump all of these coils and replace them with new coils. I wanted to replace this hose too. I'll have to see about that. We're about to get some weather. simple so this is such a simple job so I'm gonna want to replace each and every one of these coils I'm not gonna show you all of them here I'm just gonna show you the one and show you when I'm finished here I'll just complete this one all together here doing the same thing three more times so okay all right I'll show you show me doing the last one it's only taking a few minutes just to walk in the park replacing this radiator hose was going to be it's what's going to be a little slice of Hades. Okay, this is what I replaced with the car. I replaced all of these uh, coils. Back in the day, there was one, one spot and one coil, but I replaced all four of these over each spark plug. And I replaced the spark plugs. It's just a cylinder misfire on one cylinder, but they're relatively cheap. And if I was to take this one cylinder misfire to the garage, it would cost me three or four times this cost. They probably would have replaced them all anyway, but eh, it's better to give it at least a, the first try yourself. So, this is basically what I've done. I'm going to take it out for a test drive later and see how it works. And hopefully, this, this will be the last. Well, maybe not the last. I still got to replace the radiator hose. Figure out why it's overheating. Which might mean I have to replace thermostats. And there's two thermostats on this car, believe it or not. So, uh, I can do that too. It's just all according to how much aggravation I want to go through. Alright, I have not been able to make this circuit completely without my car going into lawnmower mode. Uh, lawnmower mode is what I call when your four-cylinder engine suddenly begins to run on three-cylinder. Well, I completed the circuit that usually calls my car to go into stutter mode, and I didn't appear to have a problem. So it looks like, fingers crossed, that replacing uh, the spark plugs and replacing the coils was enough. Neither one of those is very expensive, so I just did a full replacement. You know, you always replace all your spark plugs, but you don't always replace all your coils. So, 
I'm going to park here and let's see.